got to do it every time. I didn't, I didn't think I had to do it every time, but every time we do this shit, I got to like give you permission to record and shit. Right, right. Did you want to? Did you want to try the Instagram shit or just rock like this? No, no, no. I, I just went live. I'm about to invite you. All right, let me see which one you had, because like I said, you got two of them, so. I got, I got some shit too I want to talk about with you, man. You got, you got, um, what, you, you got, what are the, what are the topics today you want to dive into? I, I had just little, I had three little things I wanted to talk about. Um, some simple, um, I had the Lakers, of course, with the trades. <laughs> I had yeah, um, bro, that shit going crazy, like right now, man. As we just man. To speak, you know what I mean? This shit just going crazy, dog. They acted a fool, <laughs> man. You, you got it. You got it. You got uh, I'm at I'm at Josh the Rapper TV, or is it the other one? Oh no, no, no. Josh the Rapper. No, this is my my real account. The TV one is just like vlogs and shit. You know, I'm actually I'm live uh, now. From, I'm 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 on your other one. Okay, I see. It says live. All right, yep. Yeah. Am I on here with you or how do we do that? Request to join. Send request. Yeah, you join, but like, I don't know. I keep trying to invite you. Oh, yeah. Anyone watching can see that you're watching too. Okay. It's, it's joining. It's joining. Nice, nice, nice. Man, we got to get all this shit. Damn. Okay. All right. We in business. Look, look at us. We on two different screens in this motherfucker. You understand me? <laughs> That's what's yeah, up. Man. What I wanted to talk to you about is this podcast shit, man. We gotta push it, bro. Like I literally, I want to show you the conversion of place to money, dog. It's literally almost like one click is equal to a cent, bro. bro. Isn't that fucking crazy? So it's, look, because I'm, I'm gonna go on live for a little bit right now, right? I'm gonna show you my shit. I'm gonna show you my anchor. So right now, right? Tell me if you see this shit. I have, I have 49. You see that? Yeah. I got 49 total plays on my podcast, right? This shit equates. Look at that. 39 cents. Right, right. Yeah. You feel me? You know what I'm talking about? Like, so and I got, I, you know. I ain't going crazy yet because I only got like okay, this is my probably 18th episode. So bro, this shit is literally they give you a keys to do this shit, man. So it's just about scale at this point, man. Like fucking scaling the fuck out of this shit, bro. Getting them right. to play like anybody getting to play that shit, bro. It's almost a play equals a cent, and man, it's fucking crazy. So basically, right, if we could get 50 million plays on each of our podcasts, you know how much that is. <laughs> right. Oh my god, if you can literally figure out to get a million, one million plays too, like it's man, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm it's, gonna take this shit seriously, man. I'm just gearing up, man. Hey, we gotta, it's um, we gotta, oh, shit. it's these, it's these um things out there that we're super late to that we could um that we could help promote our our, our podcast. <laughs> it's a it's a couple of different sites. Both of these, I don't know if both of these audios is gonna work. Oh yeah, it's like you don't like it, huh? it's like fucking up the shit. shit. Yeah, because they're gonna hear they're gonna hear us talk the reverb through the through the Instagram joint. Yeah, it don't matter, man. But we we, we can show up live in a little bit. Like, I just wanna... Yeah, I don't got nobody watching mine oh, yeah, anyway. Yeah, I mean you got watching yours. I said, I, I think if this is mine, just say one person. How many people you got watching? I got one person too, man. You know, we gotta stay for a minute before shit starts getting popping on live. So yeah, so I mean, all right, but so um, where you want to go? You got something you want to talk about first? 
And that's all I want to say, man. You can go with this shit. But you're right, man. I'm, I'm going to get off live, dog. For real. This shit, nah, it's not. It's not working right now. It's working shit. This ain't working? All right. Yeah, let's, just, let's just do the Zoom, man. All right, yeah, it's all good. All right, well, shit, man. Let's yeah. dive into the Lakers, yeah. man. Like, what you think about the Lakers situation? Man, that's two chips right there. Okay, maybe not two chips, but, like, definitely next year they got it, man. I think they got it. That's all I got to say. They got this shit, bro. LeBron, AD, Carmelo, fucking Matt, Malik Monk. I don't even know that dude, man. Apparently he's good. Fuck you, They, know, they say he's a shooter. Man, um, yeah, Wayne Ellington. I don't even know that dude too, but he a shooter too. They say he, he a shooter. Fucking, um, yeah. They got oh, but the Nets got Patty Mills though. I thought we was finna get Patty Mills, man. If Lakers got Patty Mills, that's a wrap, man. Brooklyn, <laughs> Brooklyn got Patty Mills. Right yeah, so, so yeah, I guess it might be. You know, I don't know, man. I don't even know if they could beat the Bucks though. The Bucks always, you know, you can't count the fucking Bucks out, man. So if they, if, I, if I just it, know what I know. Lakers are coming out the West. I know that for a fact. If the if the Bucks don't make no moves at all, they could forget about it. Oh, okay, okay. If they don't make no like, moves like, at all, they could forget about it. DJ Tucker left too, though. So yeah, that was crazy. Like, yeah, ain't nobody gonna guard KD, man. <laughs> Why you think he left? Obviously, the money. Of course, man. Yeah. You, got ring, man. you got that ring, you ain't got shit to prove no more, man. You just go make your money. Even fucking Caruso got lost it? that one. I don't even know what they was paying him and what he got paid now. So, uh, but obviously, it's yeah. definitely always about the money. You don't win a championship somewhere and leave. It ain't about the money. <laughs> Nowadays, they doing that though. Which yeah. let, me, let me say this though: I do applaud them for controlling the narrative. Nowadays, like they, you know, owners are owners are use you up and throw you out. So players are getting smart, and they're about their bag now. So I I give them that far as that goes. LeBron, LeBron kind of, I mean, that kind of, he started that shit. That well, that's thing. different. LeBron went for a ring. He didn't go for the money. Well, fact, what? fact. But like, it's kind of the same thing, you know. At that time, it was like, nobody did that. Nobody, like, just formed their own team. Now, what Wade did when Wade went to Chicago for that $50 million for that one year, see, now that's about the money. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even like that movie, man. He that didn't, he like, didn't. Uh, he didn't go for the ring, obviously. He went strictly for that 50 mil. Pay me. <laughs> and you stayed for one year? Yeah, it was one year. Yeah. Damn. That's, that's I'm going to say it was that's one year. That's a Steph Curry deal right there. But over like one, just one year, you know? Steph Curry just signed another one, too. I, I want to say it was one year, but it might have been like a two with an option thing or opt-out thing or whatever, you know. But I know he played with him for, I want to say it was one year. And I think, did he play that whole year? I can't remember if he even played that whole year. Man, wait, wait, I had a weird career, man. You got more whole, you remember that stay he had in Cleveland? He went to Cleveland? Yeah, you see, you ain't even know. For like half a season, man, they was trying to win a ring with Braun that year, man. Oh, yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. But like, he ain't even pan out. They traded, I think they traded him before the deadline or some shit. I'm gonna have to go back and look because that's probably something that happened in. I don't. I can't remember exactly what happened in Chicago. I just remember it was a fifty million dollar deal. I can't remember how many years or what he played. I don't even think I even seen the game that he played in in Chicago. I'm pretty sure. I mean, but right now too, Chicago crazy too. Though right Chicago, now, they did some moves. Yep, they got the Rosen, they got Caruso, they got Lonzo Ball. They ain't gonna do shit, but you know, they 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 got D Rosen. Rosen, yeah, they got them. Okay, yeah, they, they got did. Miami, Miami too got Lowry. Miami got Lowry. They got that draft. They got that draft pick cat. That's from there. They got you. Just said they got um. They got old boy. They got ball. They got Levine. They got that other cat that um overseas cat that was over there last year with 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 Levine. Who's that? I can't think of his name right now, but he's decent. Tall, tall cat from overseas, white dude. He decent. I can't think of his name right now, but yeah, he he he, you know, he showed out a little bit last year or this year, I should say. But the they just like it's funny how they just like teams don't even <laughs> now it's like every year free agency is like oh shit now, you know. Motherfuckers not staying in one place no more. And that's why I said I kind of 
I said, I, I kind of applaud them for taking the business part into their own hands. As long as it ain't about chasing rings like KD did and LeBron did with Miami. As long as it ain't about that. If it's about your money, though, I'm with it. <laughs> I'm with it. Why not control the narrative? Them, white, them, them motherfucking owners is going to use you and spit you out whenever they want to. Shit. Man. Cruel game, man, and everything, man. Like, I swear, it's just a game. We're all playing games, man. Look at all the career. We're trying to figure out the podcast game, too. Like, we could be big in this space, man. I'm always just listening to this shit for days, man. And it's the consistency about it, bro. That's what we have to be. It has to be every. It has to be every whatever you said. Like if you say a week, or if you say every two weeks, your audience is going to be looking for that every single time. So the consistency is very true. Like, like I said, man. So if you if you have a hundred episodes, right, you're guaranteed a play, at least a play. You know. So that's almost a almost a cent. So with a hundred episodes, you already know you made your first dollar. Then imagine the scale, dog. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Like, I already know, bro. That scale, man. That anchor shit is so fucking like that's a source of income right there. But the main thing is promoting the podcast, man. How are you gonna get it in front of people who listens to podcasts? Like, who wanna listen to you talk for hours? Man? But see, now that now that's the thing. There's an easy way to do it. Like, it's a lot of people just doing it. Like, well, they be having more connections, obviously. Like, you got a person could be. No name, but if he comes, if Charlemagne says, "Oh, he's about to do a podcast," then of course everybody's gonna watch. Another way is you just grind like we're doing, or like how Kwame Brown got hot. It was people. Uh, no, our, our route is working. Hmm. What? Yo, our, our route is already going. Like we already know that for a fact. We not know Charlemagne come out like yo. I'm doing even fucking academics just started. Fucking, you know academics, right? Yeah, yeah, I know you got a podcast now. Yeah, he just fucking dropped a teaser too. On, um, but he ain't dropped the first episode yet, though. But that's what I'm saying. See, for him, it'd be way more easier to get it out there because of who he is. Oh, exactly. No, he already has the, you know. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. A no that's name that's could. Only a a no name could drop one video as long as he's somebody that you know that got some kind of in and get a hundred thousand views, and it could be talking about nothing. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what I was going to say, though, is um, uh, another way people do it, I started to do it, but I felt kind of guilty, so I didn't do it. So you, know how, you know who Kwame Brown is, right? Yeah. Yeah, you see he's been hot on the internet the last three months or so. People... Yeah, talk about Kwame Brown bus life. I watched that, too. Like, I mean, recently I haven't been watching the video, but like, I checked that shit out. People is literally... It's this one chick named 504. She only had, like, say, I think, like, 700 followers, right? Which is a lot compared to people that got zero. But say she had 700. She reposted a Kwame Brown video, which a lot of people is doing this now. It's like four or five of these people that got on this way. Reposted a Kwame Brown video, and now they fucking view, now they, they followers are 5,000 and 7,000 and and I started to try to do it, but I, I felt guilty. I was like, nah, fuck that. Yo, that shit easy as fuck. They've been doing that shit, though. If you can build a channel off of other people's content, it's free. It's free game for all, man. Even on YouTube right now. You're trying to watch, like, First Take, or you're trying to watch, like, um, First Things First, or you're trying to watch Undisputed, one of those shows, right? Most folks already cut, cut themselves, man. You feel me? Yeah. Already, what, like, do you feel? That that what do you feel? What do you feel? What do you... Do you think that's, like, um... I mean, do you think that's a cool way to get in, or like, do you rather grind yourself? I'm not saying that ain't game. grinding, but it's fair game, man. I don't judge nobody for how to get on, man. I swear, it's just do it like me, my way. I'd rather do shit myself, right? I'd rather grind, but it wouldn't hurt to have a couple of YouTube channels that you just do that shit with. Ain't nobody gonna know who's running them. Those names don't even nobody know who's running them YouTube channel. You know, you could literally get on them. those channels. YouTube will pay you, then you use that money to like do other shit, you know? But it's work, man. It's all about who gonna put in the work because people need that content, man. Motherfuckers, they on the fucking shit all day, man. Internet, man. The YouTube shit, they trying to watch shit all day. So, like, people are just like, just get that shit popping, you fine. Like, just make sure you get that shit popping, man. So, it wouldn't hurt, man. I've thought about it too, actually. So, so do, you, do you want to do it? We can do it. Sure. 
I don't have the energy for that kind of shit. No, I ain't got time to like. You know how to do it? Of course, easy. That part of that screen recording shit I showed you, you could screen record people's content and post that shit again. Now, is it a is it a different way to do it? Just sit there, or you don't have to sit there. You could just record it, right? Yeah, you could also figure out a screen recorder for you. Got a MacBook, right? Yeah, I don't. I ain't using. I'm using another one, but yeah, I got it. Yeah, yeah, you could literally open. You could open a um, QuickTime player. I think there's a way to record your screen with a MacBook. You figure that out. You just have to make the videos, I guess, kind of quality, man. So whenever you find some shit, you could, like you could rip that shit off. Very fucking game, man. I just don't have like I want to put all that energy into this shit, you know. I want to like get our own content out there, you know. I want to. Yeah. Really that shit is like. I ain't even built my own channel yet. Then I'm gonna try to be fucking building another channel. But that's how, but that's what I mean. That's how I seen a few people the last three months get on though. Like I was like, I mean. No, it's a way, it's a way. Like I said, man, I ain't not knocking nobody, man. Do what you gotta do. It's definitely a way, but I'd rather freak on my own, you know? All right, Um, don't judge my uh, measuring cup, right? This is one of the biggest cups in the house, so I like to use it. I love using this. <laughs> Everybody laugh at me for it though. What you, you sipping sip on? Um, that's just water right there. I, I got some beer though, you know. Just... Oh, yeah. yeah. I thought you were having a measuring cup, you know, trying to try to just disguise that shit. No, that's why that's why I use the measuring cup because it's so big. I drink my water out of this. You don't actually measure it though, do you? No, nah, I just, you know, I, I try I measured it compared to this, and that measuring cup is actually bigger. Oh, it could take more. Huh? Somebody bought me this for Father's Day. Talking about, I'm tired of you drinking out the measuring cup. Then I tested it, and this is smaller than my measuring cup. So I'm still using my measuring cup. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> hey, Matt. So listen, I seen something today. New York just passed a law where to go into their restaurants and stuff of that nature, you got to show proof of vaccination. Bro, this is a hot topic right now, man. You always on, you, you got them bangers, dog. Look, man, first of all, I want to ask you, are you vaccinated? Hell no, I never will be. <laughs> and I don't care who don't like it. <laughs> exactly. So you're on that side. Me too, man. So right now, man, it's tough for me because my family wants me to do it, bro. They're literally pressuring me right now to do that. But I haven't done it yet, you know. So I'm on the fence about it. I literally... I talked to the dude today, man. He was telling me that, nah, 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 like, he ain't gonna do that shit. See, he, like, uh, they were talking about, like, stopping you from traveling and shit, bro. Yeah, they all that. About, like, yeah, so, motherfucker said, man, I ain't gotta go nowhere anytime soon. <laughs> he said, yeah, you don't matter to him, man. He gonna, like, just stay. So, me, I kind of, because, like, man, and he also said, like, they don't even back their own pro products, man. So, if you, something happens to you, they don't, it's, you're on your own, basically. Oh, yeah. You see all the people that's been fucked up and what they say is we cannot, we can't directly direct it, we can't directly link it to the vaccination when you do get fucked up. Wow. Wow. Man, no, ain't nobody got time for that. Some bullshit, man. What the fuck? Okay. Nobody got time for that. And then this is my thing. It'd be different if we, we grew up with flus and all this and all that. I didn't get flu shots growing up. My kids don't get flu shots. And we was all right. Now we got the most deadliest they claim disease where you making us get vaccinated and all we got for it is a fucking penny hose to cover our face? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Like, so they also even offering people shit now. Like so then look, on, and then on top of that, look at this. They're saying, they're calling people that got vaccinated super spreaders now. They're saying even when you get vaccinated, you can still catch in the spread. <laughs> so, what is the point uh, of the vaccination? That's another, another thing, man. Like, so, yeah, yeah, what's the whole point? <laughs> man, I see. I, I, I feel like vaccination is some baby shit, man. It's some who? You gotta get the You get all the fucking hepatitis shit. You get all that baby. No, I'm not. I'm gonna come too long right now, man. I'm trying to enjoy my life. But. The crazy part, the crazy part, they do all this shit right in front of our faces, though. And we're so divided as a people, white, black, whatever, Asian, we all so divided. 
where we allow them to do this? Why is there not, it should be an uproar. I'm talking about the, the world should be blown, burning like George Floyd when that happened for this type of shit. You're going to tell us that we have to get vaccinated after you tell us that even when you get vaccinated, you can still catch it and spread it. You just got a, a slimmer that's chance. That's not, when you sit and think about it, man, it's wild, man. It's actually wild. Like, super know, wild. Because like, people, people are like right now, like us right now, we feel like we just stay under the radar, you know? We ain't got it. Like, it's a choice thing. Even the NFL, like, all those motherfuckers, they're not going to come out and say some shit like, yo, you can't play for our league if you're not vaccinated. They're going to get fucking crazy. They're not going to say that. Nobody going to do that, but they're going to like push. They're going to push. Do it. Do it. Man, I can't wait for all this shit to be over, man. I feel like it's just a time thing, man. We're stuck in a time warp right now, man. So, whoever, like, withstands the whole shit is basically, yeah, I'm fine, man. I'm he- I've been healthy. I'm fine. <coughs> and by I don't think so. I don't fucking shit, man, like that, man. Nah, actually, now I'm on a, I'm on a no vibe with that shit, man. They, they're trying to, like, stop shit, bro. They're trying to stop you from doing shit. Like, why the fuck do all that shit matter to you, you know? The same, and what, the, what they say is like, yeah, it's possible you could spread it. Like, you don't know you have it. What kind of disease is this in the fucking first place? Like, exactly. Exactly. Many, man, if you really want to dig deep into this fucking COVID shit, man, man, fuck all that, bro. Yeah, it's, it's deep. Like you said, this is a disease where you could have it and don't know you got it. <laughs> Exactly. So, so basically, that justifies all the vaccination shit, you know? That justifies why they can tell you, yeah, man, you got it, you know? Like, you don't even know you got it. Man, it just sounds fishy, man. Like, of course it's fishy. It fucking fishy, man. It don't so, sound man, fishy. Like, let, me even, let me give you a timeline, dog. So when this shit first hit, right, my whole family went in panic mode, man. They made, like, a whole group. They put everybody, you know, they just texting and shit like, yo, you know what? I, part of me just knew, okay, we're going to see who's going to survive this shit. I didn't, you don't know, you don't know much about it at that point, right? So my mindset was, yeah, let's see how long, you know? I want to see how shit changes, because me, I always bet, bet, bet on my health, man, you know? So right. I was like, I'm going to write that shit out, we're going to see. So, man, so bro, I'm still at that point, too, because like, at that point, I was like, why? I, like, I left the group like two seconds later, man. Like, what are you going? Like, bro, we in this, and that time it was bad. Bro, I will be Instacarting, man. Shit will be dead. Like, people were not outside. Like, it was fucking bad, dog. Like, fuck, they stopped Instacarting, like, in certain places, man. You can't even go, like, man, we forget how shit was fucked. Bro, that was some walking dead shit, man. If we're being honest, man, I remember me and you, we'd be, like, I'd be trying to, you know, <laughs> like, let go with you and, like, <laughs> fucking, like, Everything we barricaded, we gotta go. Like, man, you remember, I remember that one time too. There was literally nobody outside with us. You remember that day? Uh, that I don't remember that. Empty. I don't remember that exact day, yeah. but yeah, you know, I like, remember those days. Yeah, it was, no, 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 it was just like that shit was weird. That shit don't happen normally. Man. There's usually we're not in a place where there will be nobody. Feel me? Right. My man, bro, this whole shit, man. I don't think it'll ever be over though. I, 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 I don't think it'll ever be over though. I think this is just the baby steps for. Nah, nah, nah. Some t- oh, no, we in this shit though. No, 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 we in it. See, if you don't got the backbone, like, right now we in the middle of this shit. Before it be over, right? It's some like, we're gonna look back, man, and be like, that time, just, like, it's a gradual thing. And this shit was so big, they're trying to get you vaccinated right now. You keep saying, you keep saying look back. I don't think it's no looking back. I think we're. I think it's over with. Like they're for the escalate. If they're already passing a law in New York, no, it, shit always passes though. When well, you have to prove that you're vaccinated, even though people could get the fake cards, a lot of people got the fake cards. But still, if you got to go through that extreme, yeah. just imagine it becomes a norm after ten years. So ten years from now, everybody's gonna be vaccinated like it's the thing to do, just for they could slip. Something else, yeah, something else. I see what you're talking about. I see what you're talking about. I see exactly be, what you're talking about. You know what I'm saying? It becomes a norm once people start I'm accepting shit. You what I think, you know? I'm telling you, I'm telling you what I think is going to happen, you know? I feel like, oh, it has to end, man. But what you're saying is it might escalate, man. It, no, it's going to. Oh, it's going to. No, no, no. You're not, you can't be for sure saying that. You can oh, it's right, going to. Back, 
Most man, I, that's why you see. That's why we do these things, man. We don't look back and say, "Damn, you really said that shit." So, bro, I don't think it's it will it will escalate, right? But it'll get to a plateau, man, and it'll like fuck, like it'll be like there'll be enough of a you know to end all this fucking shit. COVID will become something, you know. We'll see how it develops disease, right? Because disease is development. So they'll get to a point where like you know. You don't have COVID. You feel me? You know you can't catch COVID. They can't keep like scaring you with the possibility that you will catch COVID. So, bro, it will get to a dead point. That's what I think. But what you're saying is different, though. So, no, it's all. That's it's all. It's you know everybody have their right to their minds. They, I don't know the future, so minds ain't obviously fact. But right, I'm right. saying though that right. I can't right. see it right. not escalating just for the simple fact is they didn't do that with the flu shot. Think about that. They didn't go through this extreme with the flu shot. They didn't go through this extreme with any other vaccination. No, no, no. When did the flu shot happen? When did you have to get a flu shot? When was it like? We've been having to get flu shots growing up, but um. So you mean like it wasn't, it wasn't like forced? It wasn't forced on nobody like this. Not like this. No, this is ridiculous. And and think about it. If this is so bad, this having even killed is means people as the flu have. They're calling. They're calling this the deadliest situation. You bring, uh, you bring some fucking facts, man. You like science. You like all that shit. Up. That's crazy. What? I didn't know that. Yeah, this it's hasn't even killed this me as people as flu. For something to be a fucking vaccine where you have to get it, it has to take people, man. Like, but my thing is this: Why is they going so hard for something that for this? Why? It's a reason. It comes out of nowhere. They knew about yeah, it, it first. Be, of all. Maybe that sixty-six shit, bro. It might be that sixty-six. You you believe in the Bible? Yeah, well, I believe in um, I believe in I believe in a creator. I believe in you know, I grew up calling it God, calling the creator God, and I grew up through a Christianity back like you know, like my that I went to church for. But I'm not, I'm not Christian, and I don't, I don't, I don't subscribe to like all the stories in the Bible. I do believe there's a creator. And I say God just because you know that's why I grew up on. But, but yeah, I don't know about all that stuff in the Bible though, really. Yeah, man. So it's like basically sick baby, it's like the mark of the beast, man. You know. Yeah, I I know about that, the revelation. I know, I know, I know you know. So like this might be that, that kind of shit. That's what that's what I'm thinking, man. That's where you're going with this shit. You can never, you can never yeah, and, and, did, now did you hear about that's the, like the mark of the beast situation? They've been putting they've been putting chips in people for the last four, five, six years. And like people in cards, you talking about cards? No, chips in your in your body. Like people was like signing up to get them. Like you could go buy them. And and, oh, and I, I didn't know that. Yeah, you could go buy them. And, and they had it on the news where they was asking one lady, what made you want to go get the chip? Because they could, you know, you could go grocery shopping, you could open your car door. You can open your apartment door, you know, stuff like that, your job doors and said, blah, blah, blah. And they said, what, what would make you get the chip? And she said, well, you know, times and technology move so fast, you got to keep up with the, with the Joneses. She literally said. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, gotta, you ain't got to go to your body, though. I don't think you should go to it, man. You can keep up with technology, like, with other ways, man. You ain't got to, like, put no fucking chip in your shit, man. Well, yeah, so that's the market. I didn't, know that. I didn't know that. That's some new fucking information, bro. I did not know that. Yeah, you could go buy that shit, man, right now. Well, I don't know, like, if they regulated from state to state. This state was, I want to say this was Virginia that this one was in. Oh, yeah, so what, what? why would you get it? That's actually a good question to ask. Like, why would someone fucking get a chip? Like, what, what's the uses of that shit? But you see what the woman replied? She's so damn, she has no, she obviously don't give a fuck about the market of beast or even know about her any of that shit. <laughs> obviously don't know nothing about it. Hello. 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 So nah, you, that's what I mean. You got people in this world that's just like, we we think sometimes that people are certain, no, people are just sometimes just slow as shit, man. <laughs> it's just saying, you know, like, I don't know. Be, I don't know, maybe like you said, you go open your car door and you could like cook and you could, you know, it's just people like convenience, man. Oh, that's all life is. That's all life is, is yeah. instant gratification. Yeah. Yeah. That's like, that's, that's like when people, 
That's like when people ask you, do you do cash app for cash? For for businesses, that's obviously cash. And you tell the person, do you do cash? That means you want to inconvenience me to convenience yourself. Well, what, what do you mean? Like, for you know, it's some businesses in the world where you only use cash. You know what I mean? And you have you have people come to you talk about, I want to do cash app. You like, I either got to go to the ATM to get that money or to the bank. To get uh, <laughs> that happens all the time. So I got to use my gas to go get my money. But you know what? I, t- I feel like, no, I feel like that shit should change, you know? I feel like that should change. Like, like we should be more digital with money, you know? It doesn't have to be all that Bitcoin shit. Like, cash is just, man, I mean, trust me, I like cash. Like, you know, I just like to see that shit. Like, I like to count it, and, you know? I'm not going to floss. I mean, I've done that before. I ain't going to lie. But, like, I'm not... Man, I just want to say some shit, man. <laughs> but, like, yeah, um, sometimes, man, you just want to count cash, man. Or, like, sometimes I would just, like, literally put cash on the floor. In the studio. On the floor in the studio, right? Right. And I just rap, my nigga. Like, you feel me? It makes me feel like I put, like, a $1,000 on my That floor. makes you go hard? <laughs> no, you just like, yeah. This is the motivation. Me, like, yeah, like, I, I have times too where, like, I posted that shit on my story and shit, you know. But right now, my stance on that is cap, man. So, what I'm trying to say is, like, I'd rather be more digital money, man. There's a lot of ways you can build money. I'm not talking that Bitcoin, none of that. For, I'm talking about real cash, but, like, you need to look at it in a more. I, I maybe you just feel like, I don't know, how do you feel about cash and, like, digital shit? Like, would you rather be, like, Pablo Escobar and just have, <laughs> just have the cash? Or you rather, like, be like me? And like, you know, I just want to be. I, I, I think everything. <laughs> I think everything serves its purpose, of course. You know what I mean. But which one? Our breath. Which one? Which one? You said what? You both sides. Like you fucking with both sides. You, you have yeah, I see the benefits. I see the benefits in both. But what? What I rather. So, cash is just more of a way. You don't have to have the ties. You know what I mean? Like, not even if you don't have to be doing nothing wrong in life, but why would you want every single time you want to buy something, people looking at your numbers in the computer world? And you know what I'm saying? Like, people got access to, access to you every single time you swipe a card. Like, that's, that's, you know what that's, I mean? That's it's why, just. That's why cash not going to ever go out of style because of that, that whole ghost shit, man. You can ghost. You can really ghost, man. You don't have to. Motherfuckers got like, Deposit boxes, man. They just have cash in that shit, you know, save some for it. And, and why would you? Bank accounts, man. You move around like and cash is like go like you think about cash, this. Right? your card ain't gonna decline or anything, you know. You know I mean? you ain't you ain't gotta worry about nothing. You don't have to like, yeah, cash just makes you puts you in control. Yeah, think about this. We all know this and some people don't, I guess, like that. That woman that says she don't mind getting a chip. We all know that the rich stay rich and the poor stay poor. So people is getting paid off of our money for no fucking reason. We all know that. When you put it in banks and stuff of that nature, you know what I mean? Like, and all that stuff, like, man, everything people is getting paid off us. The the every they getting paid off everybody. Them one percenters get paid off everybody for us being so damn connected with this with these numbers. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's why some ideals from some groups that I don't I don't agree with all they stance, but people like um the Masons, um, I mean the um the Moors, I mean my fault, the Moors, like how they think. Like they don't use social security numbers. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Who are the Moors? You gotta talk about it. I mean, you ain't gonna say shit like that and just like gloss over it. Oh, what well, shit people just gotta you know the the, the more the Morse Americans, the Moors. You know they. they Morse, M O R S E. Yeah, I think that's how you spell. It, I believe. Oh, so wait, what are those? I don't know. They, yeah, um, it's it's a lot to break down right now. We have to do a whole show about that. People could just oh, no, look no, it up. Just give a, give you know what I'm saying? It's just a, it's just what oh, people. Right. It's just what some people call a secret society. I guess you know what I mean. It's just. Yeah, yeah. You talking about like Freemasonship? 
Yeah, it's like pretty much that people, they don't use social security numbers. You know what I'm saying? They don't call themselves black. You Wait, there's people saying? like that that don't got social security numbers? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. I didn't, you see, bro, you got to understand that, like, I don't know some of these things you're talking about, man. Like, for real. Like, I just, I'm asking you questions and shit because, like, I'm trying That's to all good. Out. It's I, all good. I know that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know that, man. I know yeah. I heard about shit like that, but, you know, it's all, like, it's all, like, fiction until, like, you actually hear it from someone who knows they actually exist, you know? You probably met someone like that. Have you met yeah, yeah, I, I I met a few people growing up like that. I mean, I even know a cat now that's that's one. And he he been wanting me to get down. And I, you know what? And this is my thing. I don't call myself nothing. You know what I'm saying? I I just like to look at everything and take bits and pieces out of every, everybody's situation. You know what I mean? But, um, it's 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 interesting because I never, I haven't obviously got a chance to see how it works trying to live without social security number. You know, I know these cats talk about it and say they do it, but I I haven't did it myself or lived with nobody in the same house that did it or whatever. But the shit that froze up, uh, we back. Hey, boy, aren't you, aren't you, can you hear me? What was the last thing you heard? The, the computer froze. No, you heard nothing. I heard everything you said. Aren't you, oh, okay. like, so, what I was gonna ask you is, aren't you supposed to be born? With um, you know, with um, what they call it, with a social like, how how do they? I don't know how that shit is even assigned, dog. I thought you was born with that shit, you know. How do you well, the, not having one? Well, the way it works is you're born with one because you become an ent uh, entity. You're a business now, so we're, we're fucking business for the for the government. Yeah, that's what I mean by like. It's so that's oh, just no, so. Do they assign you one at birth? Yeah, they assign you one at birth. You become a. Okay, so how do you escape? Boy. Just talk about people who don't have one, man. How, how don't you, how can't you, you can, can you like expunge your social security number or some shit? Well, the way they, they you know, they got, they, it's ways you can look up and do it however they do it. You know, it's public fucking knowledge the way they do it. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I haven't lived with nobody that did it before and I haven't did it myself. I just know people that call themselves that and they say they do it. So I haven't seen it firsthand. You know what I mean? Like a motherfucker could tell you anything. You know what I mean? But. Okay. But I haven't lived with nobody or seen it myself, like my own eyes. Oh yeah. You know, but yeah, so they I, say. I, I, I mean, so, so the process is like they, you, have, you obviously have one at birth, right? Yeah, you have a or, social security number at birth. Yeah. So, okay, so then they, they do, they definitely do something to just like explain, you, like it doesn't exist no more type shit. Well. I, I used to know exactly how I went by talking to people and reading a little bit too. Back, you know, you know, I used to go, I used to be incarcerated a lot when I was a shorty. So I used to know that type of shit. I used to know a lot of stuff about muzzles and everything. I don't forgot all that shit now, but um, you know, you, you can look it up, you know, you can you can always look it up or whatever. You're gonna make me look it up again. Cause it's actually it's, it's a good thing if you do it. I guess you could do it like um. You know, like you could, you know, you could tax write off everything through a business, through an LLC. So I don't know if that's the same thing as far as not using your social security number, but you could don't, you could not use your name pretty much to, for, you could get LLC and use that for everything. You only have to use your name no more. So I want, I mean, it could be the same thing. I definitely, bro, trust me, I know that part. Yeah, so I'm kind of, yeah, I think it's the same thing. It's kind of funny. You don't, you don't got to use it here for shit in this country, man. You don't gotta use that name for shit. Like, right. really good. You don't gotta, yeah, yeah. But they, there's gotta be a way, man. I just be, yeah, they, I need to know. Uh, like, if they exist, then that's yeah. crazy. Because, like, they make you think, like, you need an SSN to work. They make you think, like, you need, you don't, man. You really don't. It might be, shit, man. it might be real expensive to live like that. Crazy. It might, it might. Man, it don't matter. Man. It's what you choose. How you wanna live. You trying to live like that or like a normal you would be, man. They must see they must see the perks, man. Like they do that shit for a reason, you know. I no, I like I like the idea. I, I would love to live under the radar, not even under radar, like you hiding out, but far as name wise, I would love to live like that. Cause that's how I am anyway. I tell them off for eight different names. Too. That's that's the goal. That's actually the goal, man. Cause like like you said, man, America takes your fucking soul, man. They trying to just take everything away from you, man. So if you can figure out a way. We already, man, I got bank accounts, like, I'm already in the system, man, so you just have to, 
not, you know, do shit where like you're in the fucked up, you know, you, 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 you know, it, there's perks to that shit, man. There's ways to like use credit to like make money, man. You know, just have like fucking. 50k credit limits type shit. You say, you know, that's like you could make more moves. You could literally that that's another appeal for that shit. You could if you go into all that shit, you could just triple your shit. I've only had one credit card my entire life, man. One. And like I don't fuck with credit too. Credit's like I don't like it, but there's a way to get back to just like give you money, man. But it's not as far as that now, as far as that go, no, you you know, credit is one of the things where if you got cash. Cash is cool, but if you want to, you could definitely leverage yourself to a nice position with credit. Oh, no, no, no. Hey, man, bro, I'm trying to, but that's the thing, though. I don't, I don't believe in that shit, so I never want to go that route. I'd rather you say you don't, you don't believe in what, credit? Yeah, no, I don't want to have, like, I don't care how much you can make doing that, you know. I don't want to just have that, you know. I might at some point, you know, because, you know, if you get less. I tell you. I tell you, I tell you a small way which you could do this big way. Look at the small way, right? Say you go to like say J.C. Penney's and open up your credit card line, right? And you go in there and you you go in there and buy you two outfits. You go to the counter, use your J.C. Penney card, right? <laughs> say it's two fifty, right? As soon as you pay for it with your JC Penny card, that's 250 credit that you're gonna do right there. Bam. What, yes. As soon as that transaction is done, you go right in your pocket and pay them people 250 right then and there. Right then and there. Exactly. People don't do that though. Nobody does that shit. Nobody does that. Only only people like you probably that do that. Bro, niggas wanna see credit gives you, you see, that's why I said making money, man. Because you could go the other side of credit. You could go the other way and just be in debt like a motherfucker and fucking ruin your life. You can't even do shit in America. So it's all it's all a game, man. So it's rather me, I'm, I'm more cash, but I see the benefits of just having digital money, you know? Yeah, so so in terms of like, like the whole picture, I'm definitely more cash. But like in terms of making real money, you know, just to have the same cash you're about to have in your hand, right? Have right. It, and having like systems like a high interest savings account, you know, just like little things you can just do with your money, man. That like multiply, but it's still your money, you know. It's still your fucking money. Like, are you heard? Are you heard of a Roth IRA? Yeah, I got one. Of course you got one, man. Yep. <laughs> but yeah, that shit, yeah. you like that? Fuck you, that shit is cold, man. I did that. You know, back and you, you, know you know what you you know you know what you do is if you got a girl. You open if you got a girl that never heard of one of those, you open up her one. Okay. You know, you get you one and you open up her one. Just wow. something, something simple like that is something that definitely put you in the game. Far as a woman saying, "Damn, she ain't even know about something like that." It's, it's <laughs> like, I, was it's trying, a, I was trying to see where you were going. That but shit. It's a, but it's I, a. But, I was to go, that shit. No, but, no, you're, no, but you're, no, but you're no, investing no, in her. No, no. No, no, definitely. When you show like a woman shit like that, they're like, oh, damn, this motherfucker, like, you know, I'm like, yeah, hey, bro. You could. I told you about it a while back. I was like, oh my God, like, I got to do this. I played the game, but I took, you're not supposed to take the money off of it. I took hey, look, my shit off of it. <laughs> you, could, that bitch, bro. you could buy <laughs> one of those. You could open one of those for $500, and that's better than a $5,000 purse. You don't even have, you don't need money to open one of those. I'm just saying you well you no you do no you you do have to have um it is a limit down like 500 or whatever it's like a, it's 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 no, a, no, 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 no. for the no, roster it is no i what what rock do you use what what company um i forget the just out here we're out here in Nepal. but well Bro, if you uh, if you did right? yeah it was i i want to say it was a i want to you say what what do you say Yo, Vanguard, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Yo, Vanguard, man, like, that's what I used when I used to do this shit. So, like, it doesn't cost you nothing. You don't have to have nothing to start that shit. All you got to do is put money in that shit and buy index funds. It's literally companies, right? It's 
like 50 companies in one stock. So like right. if 47 of those companies are doing good, you're making money, man. Bro, but I you have money. to, you can't open it with zero. How would you have money in it if you open it with zero? No, bro, you can open it with zero. How? You don't, have, you don't have to have money. Just open an account and have it right there and put money in it. Right. You don't have to have, you That's don't the have same difference. Money. No, you're saying you have to have a certain amount of money to open. Okay, I'm saying so you can't. I'm saying leave it like that. You know, you can you cannot start off at zero and leave it because okay, what can they? If if it doesn't gain, what where are they getting? Like, if they get if they let you open up a Roth account with zero dollars and you don't put no money in there, how are they? What what? They won't be investing in another. No, 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 no. Exactly. You can have a Roth that has zero dollars. You can build your Roth if you wanted to. It don't cost you to put money in the Roth. You know, just make a little, it, make a little forty bucks. You put that bitch in there. Make thirty bucks. You put that bitch in there. Your money starts piling up. It's just an account to have fun with, man. So right, you but zero, you you can have zero and start. You know, you don't have to do shit. Everybody can start. You know, you don't need a limit. You don't need an amount of money to start. You feel me? That's all I'm saying. I'm not saying you shouldn't build it. How are you going to open up an account with zero dollars, though? People do that all the time, man. A Roth account. This ain't no regular checking account. Exactly. No, no. People. Okay, you're right. You're not supposed to. If you, okay. You just this have, is a retirement have, account. Have, no, I feel you have. Okay, let's see. You can set, a, you can set 10 bucks. You feel me? You don't need yeah, you have to put something in there. <laughs> you gotta put something in there. Oh, I mean, by choice, yeah. But no, you, you cannot open it up for zero and have zero. Like you can't. It's a rock. I, I, like, I know exactly what you're saying. We're not. We're not talking about different things, bro. Right. You, you cannot. Have to, you have to build it. You have to build it. But we're just talking about the start. You don't need. See, there's accounts, right? Like with Gateway City City Bank. You cannot open an account if you don't have a certain amount of money. All I'm saying is you don't need no money to open a Roth IRA account. That's all I'm saying. You okay, well, hey, I got mine like five years ago, and I put five hundred down in mine's and and, and my own. I said I had mine for like five years. I put I put like five hundred down when I opened mine. Oh, that's cool, man. So I don't even that shit is personal information, man. I, I want to get back in that game. I just got into like some rocky times, man, because. I needed that money, you know. I couldn't. I wasn't in a position to play with money no more. <laughs> I was working at 3 a.m., dog. I, I was like making. And I used to live with my bro at that time, so I wasn't paying rent. I wasn't doing none of that shit. So I had money to just fuck around with. So I literally opened it, built it to like four bands, and took the money out. <laughs> yeah. You're not supposed to take the money out till you're. I think it's 53, and they told me, "Yo, there's a penalty. There's a penalty, bro." No penalty, bro. Cash, straight cash. I made like seven hundred dollars profit, man. The whole idea is to build the money as you grow older, right? When you get to like fifty nine, you take it out because like that shit, bro. Imagine all those years of interest, interest. Right, right, no doubt. But yeah, you know that's all. If you build that shit, that shit is that should take discipline, though. You got to bet on yourself because life ain't going. You know, you don't know oh, yeah, about definitely. life, man. Uh, it could leave, man. So you gotta have a fucking beneficiary that the money goes to. You don't want your money to just be in a fucking void. I'm, I bet there's a lot of people like that. You and know, you know that you know that all works off of stocks though. That that RA and all that, like even that jobs with 401k and all that, you know that all works off of stocks. So you know like oh, no, older, no, no. of course, of course. Yeah, so the older you get to, you know, that's the plan that that motherfucker gang, but shit, stocks is a funny thing. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. No, no, no. We go, man. Me and you, we get crack. Like, I like how we just go on fucking tangents and just talk about a random fucking shit, bro. We literally, I don't even know how long this shit been going, man. This is like our best episode so far. So what I'm I gonna look- do is I'm gonna chop. I'm gonna chop. What you say? No, nah, I'll say I thought you looked to see how long it's been. How long it's been? Oh, you, can- oh, okay. you go off, right? Oh no, no, no. Oh yeah. yeah. So this, I feel like it's our coldest episode so far. So like. Bro, I'm a chop. I, I we got two episodes I haven't. But I saw you posted the one on YouTube, but I haven't posted yet. I'm just like trying to, cause I did, I did one with my guy, one of my guys. I made a song with before, so 
I got three episodes, man. I got to, like, work on, man. So, I guess I'm about to go through that, man. You know, trying to put, these, put this shit out here, man, you know? Yeah, no doubt, no doubt. All right. But, yeah, we, we have, we have, man, bro, got to got to hoop at some point, man. I be practicing, man. Oh, man, you ain't. I was, I was 50% from three in front of you, man. I made the second shot. What's what's today? Today is um Tuesday. <laughs> we could go Saturday morning outside right there at the Cahuga Cahu. Same, same spot. Wherever they whatever it's called, yeah. Oh no, but not same, not, not same, not the same spot where, where I drained that three. No, right there off of um off of thirty five over there off of over there by the bus station, the the city bus station over there on Cahuga, I think it's called. It's a park over there. But no, no, let's, let's do let's do that. Let's do that Sunday, man. Let's do that Sunday. Sunday. Yeah, let's let's that'll be our shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. I think I, I gotta I gotta I gotta take my son out to um my youngest. We going out to sell um lemonade and juice and shit on Sunday. Well, if you know, no, like, like it could be like you know, I mean, what time? Evening time? You gonna be if you're busy around that right time? Then we could just you know we'll figure it out. We'll figure that shit out. We'll definitely figure it out. But yeah. What you say? You said Thursday, right? No, no, you know, like I said, no, 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 no. Thursday we're going to Zoom. Sunday, we're supposed to, you know, you know me? So you be, why are you talking like you don't know this shit? Are you talking about myself? I don't know what you're talking like. You bro, just, Sunday, don't know what you're talking about. Listen to me, man. Listen to me, man. Sunday, the time I was to do this shit, right? Oh, fuck it. Go through that, you know, just for like an hour, just like, cool. Oh, you know me? Yeah, so you ain't got to tell me. Guys, fucking, you know, you know the vibes, man. Don't be, All right. don't, don't mess around. With that. Yeah, <laughs> All right, so what's it? Just let me I'm know, gonna, man. I'm gonna let you know, though. Of course, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna definitely let you know, man. All right, man. I guess like next, next episode, dog. This is a million, million, million dollars worth of game. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> no, don't do that. Don't do Bro, that. I'm gonna do that shit so smooth, man. Like, now I'm gonna just be like, million dollars yeah, no. again. Don't do that. My they gonna sue your motherfucking ass. Don't do that. <laughs> catch you. Oh shit. We gonna catch you on the next episode, man. Alright, it's all. It's all good, man.